is at probably 100 yards to the east of me here. So, getting in the street did not go well. It just could have gone worse. Like, I dropped my arrow. I lost one of my arrows coming in here. I kept dropping stuff. It took forever. One of my, my platform came uncammed. I just, ah, oh, got me really mad. So, hopefully the hunting's not the same way. That's that one that I have a camera on. It is. Keep it there. Yep, that's that one. Yeah! Right? It was real steady, I didn't have any rest. And he was like 
sort of gorging deal, like, slash frontal. So I didn't want to take that shot, but it would have been a real quick shot, so I don't... Then I looked at his antlers, I didn't know if I wanted to shoot him for a second, but I was probably going to shoot him. Then he ran off, I think he saw me. Bleh. Good. Oh my goodness. 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 Dude, I just went down. Thank you, Lord. Yes! Yes! Oh my goodness, he's down right there. That buck is so stinking cool. He came in literally to like, I don't know, freaking 15, 20 yards. I don't even know what to say. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Oh. Dude, that thing's a stud. That thing's a freaking stud. His brow tines are giant. Oh my goodness. Yes. Dude, this morning has been outstanding. There's a buck over there. There's a there's a shooter buck there and there. There, that's three bucks. That thing is a big buck. I see it dead right now, dude. I'm pretty positive it. I saw it fall. I think I see it dead. It's 9:21 right now, November 15th. Opening gun season in Michigan here. That's that buck. That was it Sunday night. I, after we left, he was in that field there. And with the car lights, we could see him and we videoed him. But he was out there chasing a doe. But he came in, I could not mess this up. Like, cause I messed up two other bucks. Dude, absolute stud though. I really hope he's down because I don't know where I hit him, but he was stumbling, so. I just had a free hand it. I just, it was 20 yards, I free handed it, and hopefully he's down. Dude, but absolute stud. That's, oh my gosh. He's a big buck. That's my second buck ever, if we can find him. Oh. All right, we're gonna get down. All right, it's been like an hour since I shot him. I was gonna wait for my dad, but he said he's gonna stay out in the woods for another hour, so. I can't help it, I wanna go put my hands on this deer. Um, go at least see him and then um, when my dad gets here, we'll get some good pictures and stuff like that. But I can't help it no more, I have to go find him. I'm pretty sure I saw him fall over and saw him dead. So 
I just can't handle the urge to go find them anymore. So we gotta go. Um, but I mean, just can't be happier right now if we can find them. So. Just took my hat off. Came out of there. I think I shot him, right here. There he is, oh my goodness. There he is, yes. Yes, dude, yes. Oh, he's right there, dude. Oh my gosh, dude, there he is. There he is, there he is. Yes, yes. Oh my goodness. What did I do? Dude, yes, oh. perfect shot right through the shoulder, top of the shoulder. That's where I aimed. Oh, my goodness, what, what a nice buck! Heck yeah, dude. Look at all this blood, dude. He died real fast. He died real fast. Oh, my gosh. I mean, if you guys are watching to this far, I just want to thank you guys. I mean, this has been a journey for this year for me. I mean, I haven't had any good chances on any good bucks. I mean, to get opportunity on that stud for Michigan is just, it's unbelievable. I mean, that normally doesn't happen very often. And, you know, what a unique buck. It's crazy. I don't know. Thank you guys so much for just tuning in. I mean, we're going to get some sweet photos and all that.